Hi, this is Allison, and I am going to be showing you a quick little tip today. Um, all of these beige blocks are going to be getting a custom block design in them. Now, what I could do is use the boundary tool and pick all four corners of each block, but there is an awful lot of them. So what I did was I measured this block. It's a five-inch block. So I dug through my rulers. I got my little two-and-a-half-inch square here. I'm going to pop that in the corner of each square and I'm going to mark a dot where that tip is. So that's the center of my block. I have a block picked out on Mach 3. I sized it to four and a half since this is a five inch block. That'll give me just a quarter inch of wiggle room all the way around. I'm going to take my sew head and center it right on that blue dot. Then I'm going to come over here to Mach 3 and you'll see the I'm zoomed way in. This is my sew head. And this is my four and a half inch um, square pattern over here. And I'm going to go to the positioning tool up here at the top. And what you want to do is it says grab method. You want to go down to click center. I'm going to grab it right at the center of the pattern and make sure your input says sew head. So I'm going to go over here and click my pattern and it's going to snap right to the center of the sew head, which is centered in that block. So you just come back to your sew head. Um, you can drop it if you want to by clicking this little icon on lightning stitch and it'll change and show that you drop that pattern. And otherwise, you just click go on Mach 3 um, right here and it's going to sew that little pattern right in the center of that square. Now I'm going to stop it and show you one more thing. When you want to go to the next block, all you have to do is go over to the blue dot, click grab it again, it's going to move back to the center of this next block and sew again and you just keep doing that. So all you have to do is use your little two and a half inch square, mark your center in each of these dots and move around from each center point to center point. Hope that helps you guys work a little faster. Thanks and take care.